Hey guys, guess what we're doing? There you are. We're going to the beach. Yep. Get in the back, Sammy. Get in the I back. I am, Tim. <laughs> Good morning. It is a beautiful, gorgeous, stunning. You're watching Fireball Malibu Vlog, and this is episode 644. And you got the coolest hat on ever. I know. Yeah, all in preparation for Kathy's little jaunt, little skipperoo over to Hawaii. Co coming soon. Her flowers. Yeah, gotta have flowers in the hair or in the hat, as they say. Somebody says that, I don't know. Uh, what are we doing today there, uh, little sweetheart? We've been doing a lot of things for ourselves, and I think today we need to do something for the doggies. However, they like the same thing we like. Funny how that so, works out. we're going to the beach. The whole beast to ourselves. It's Monday. Everyone on the weekend has already left. Kathy's doing a little bit of beach cleanup. Oh, I see. Some more. That's a starfish. Oh, I got to take a picture of that. We've been finding all kinds of trash. Kathy just went around the corner to start filling up bags of trash. I found a bunch of sandals right here, but I also found something even more interesting. A gold wedding band. Oh! I have found the other half of something you found. I'm not sure. Okay, he found the other one. That's pretty rare. They get separated and those are together. But they're huge. <laughs> I'm not sure what size they are, probably a 12. You give him Bashan. My turn to hit over there with an empty bag. Check out, see if I can find some uh, some trash. I think there's quite a bit, according to what Kathy said. What a nice day. There is way too much trash to be able to pick up with just a few bags, including beach toys and more sandals. And here's what we found today. That's the sandals we found on the beach today, plus this beach toy right here. And here's a few others that we've found just in the last couple of months. Lunata Bay, PV. Time to head.
head up into town because Kathy has her amazing list of things that I absolutely cannot identify. Well, I have to make things with all the tomatoes that we're growing. <laughs> so I'm gonna make tomato sauce, I'm gonna make salsa. Mm -hmm. We have one tomato plant that uh, we, we didn't plant. I don't it, know. It grew itself. I have no idea how it got there. It grew itself. And so far we have maybe, is it safe to say we've had about 100 tomatoes? Oh yeah. And there's still 100 more. But the worst part is there's two other tomato plants. The tomato plant itself is as big as a tree. <laughs> And they're, but they're little tiny, I don't even know what kind of tomatoes they are. Oh, they're cherry maybe, tomatoes. maybe cherry tomatoes. They're very tangy. Uh, they're very delicious for the salsa. There's enough to go around this entire town. We'll have to put bags together and, and give people. No, I'm making pasta sauce. Okay, all right. He has spotted a house for sale. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Down on Malibu Road again. Let's go see if we can find one. Open houses, but the houses have not been built yet. Yeah, so I'm not going to be open. It's a piece of land. It's an open lot. That's big Mike's house. You know, the guy with the marijuana. Ferrari. The bad news is there are no houses. I don't know what that sign was in reference to. Maybe those empty lots? That's what I think. Yeah. But the good news is we saw a pot Ferrari. Well, we saw it the other day. That's true. Marijuana. Marijuana. Ferrara. Ferrara wanna. He's a marijuana millionaire. It is a stunningly gorgeous day, but big thanks to Nissan because they just sent me something brand new. It's big, it's bold. Actually, it's quite enormous. This is the Nissan Titan. requires a brand new car, and in this case, a brand new truck. A really, really, really large truck. So I have this truck all week long. We got some plans, some interesting things that we're gonna do with it. But before we take the Nissan anywhere, we need to get some exercise. And even though we had a great time this morning going to the beach, Kathy wants to take a walk. And when Kathy takes a walk, it's not like a little jaunt or a little stroll. It's like epic. And something tells me we're gonna go back to the beach again. Oh look, it's her mermaid.
as a car designer, I'm always playing around with ideas, with uh, sketches and things. Uh, I don't really know where they're going to go. Sometimes it'll go for a concept leading to a build. It might go for a, a toy idea. It might go for the next Wheels and Waves card. But just doodling around with some fun little knickknacks. Kind of like that one. Looks like a little Japanese hot rod. Traditional hot rod kind of thingamajig. Or even a little box looking thing that makes no sense whatsoever. And you gotta realize that every car that you see on the road started out as a doodle like that. In fact, I know a few people, you're probably watching the vlog right now, are sketching an idea on a napkin at a car company when the, the big cheese walks behind you and says, hey, what is that? We should build that. I'm sure that's happened to a few of you. And you know I'm talking to you, right? Case in point, uh, the 2017 Nissan Titan started out as a you know, a sketch. And that sketch led to lots of approvals and disapprovals, whole evolution of things, and lo and behold, a few years later, boom, it turns into a truck. I'm gonna need my glasses for this one. Now I have this truck for a week, I'm gonna be doing some interesting things with it. Honestly, I don't really know yet. Chances are, as we do with most cars, we, we drive it. You do here on the vlog isn't the standard review stuff. You can get that in a million different places. You're not gonna get that here. You're gonna get us driving the truck like it's a real car in a real situation. What's it like to put surfboards in the back? What's it like to put your dogs in? What's it like to, to carry groceries? What's it like just to have it in your life? And this truck at around $48,000 better be cool. It's something that it should enhance your life in some way. And with a Cummings 5 liter V8 turbo diesel, this thing should have some get up and go. I'm just saying, it should. And it does because it's got 310 horsepower. 555 foot-pounds. You know what I'm talking about. So if I wanted to drag around, let's say, someone's mother-in-law, that wouldn't be a problem. Or if I want to, like we're going to do tomorrow, pile a bunch of surfboards in the back and head to the beach, that's what we're going to do. It's a duty truck and we're going to do some duties in it. Really shouldn't have said it that way. Because this is Fireball Malibu Vlog and our job here to help you, you, improve your life through what you love. Okay, thanks for watching. Lots of cool stuff coming up. Really cool stuff. Wheels and Waves, of course, is happening this weekend. The thing that really gets me excited is not so much about the cars that are in the show, but it's the people in the show. We're going to have a, have a blast. It's like all my friends show up to this one big party. And I know some of you, and I'm grateful that some of you come from great distances. So because you're coming from a great distance, I'm going to have coffee for you, and I'm going to have a Hot Wheels for you. We're going to have some great music, and we're going to have some bitching cars.